Hello and welcome back to ENS Gadgets. Now if you're new here, kindly subscribe so you get to know when I post more gadgets and how-to videos. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to fix and resolve the SUDS or SUD error on your Samsung machine. If your machine shows the SUDS error code, it simply means you're using detergent improperly. If your washing machine has the word SADS on the display, it has detected an over sadsing condition and will stop for a short period to allow the SADS to dissipate. This error code is usually caused by too much detergent or the wrong type of detergent. Now today's washing machines don't use nearly as much water as their predecessors. Machines in the past used up to 40 gallons of water per cycle. This meant more detergent was needed to clean clothing. Today's machines utilize less than half that amount, ranging between 11 to 15 gallons per wash. Therefore, using more soap is simply going to result in more suds in the wash. Now, high efficiency detergents contain stain fighters, boosters, stronger cleaning agents, and fabric softeners. So next time you are buying detergent for your machine, make sure to see and HT on the detergent so you know it's high efficiency. If you are already using the HE detergent and your machine is displaying the SADS error code, you may be using too much detergent. Please follow the detergent manufacturer's suggested amount of detergent. There are many different concentrations of laundry detergent, so make sure to get the correct one for your machine. So, fixing the SAD error requires you to just give your machine uh, some time for the SADs to dissipate. Once they've dissipated, the machine uh, begins again, or uh, rather continues uh, doing the wash cycle. After the completion of the wash cycle, uh, you, you should now clean the drain filter. Yeah, it's important you, you, you proceed to clean uh, the drain filter. However, before you open the pump filter, I'd advise you drain water from your machine using the emergency hose pipe. If you don't do that, a ton of water can spew from the machine and flood the floor of your house. This is the, the emergency hose. And now you open it. Because you need to drain the water just open it slowly just open it just open it like this you can see all this dirt you can see all this dirt as you can see now it's empty so we can proceed to close yeah, you just return this cover like this and now we've closed then uh, once you've closed you can return this now there like that after you've drained the water now you can proceed to open the pump filter in fact it's recommended to always clean your filter between three to four months because you never know what might be inside there and once you clean your filter uh, you know your machine becomes more efficient uh, just remove all the dirt you know particles and any objects you find in that filter you might even find your kids socks in that filter so just make sure to remove all the dirt after that you clean the pump filter then you return it oh my god this is bad yeah it's like the pump is already clogged, 100% clogged. That's why this machine, uh, it was like yesterday it showed uh, a SUD error. Yeah. Oh, you can imagine all these particles coming out of the pump. Oh my goodness. Oh, make sure to clean yours eh? today. Just make sure to clean your machine today so that... Uh, it is efficient, yeah? It's very, very important to always, always uh, uh, clean your machine. It is always... important to clean your machine. And it's important to remove like all, all 
the dirt, yeah? You make sure everything, there's no clogging, yeah? Yeah. You ensure there's no clogging, you just remove like all, all the dirt. Yeah. Like that. So now that place is clean. It's clean. Now we just need to to return this pump filter and to return it you just have to like that until it is closed. It's even written open close so now and that's how to clear the SUD error code. Now if you found this video helpful kindly share with your friends and also give it a thumbs up. See you in the next one. Bye bye.